So today we are here with Lucas, who is a product manager for the architecture components. Welcome, Lucas. Hi. Nice to talk to you. Thank you. <laughs> so tell us a little bit about architecture components. Okay. So uh, with architecture components, we kind of listened to developers that said that it can be challenging sometimes to deal with the life cycles of Android apps. Uh, and particularly with us not giving a lot of guidance about you know, how to do core app architecture. And so we're kind of launching two sets of things. And one is some components that help deal with things like, you know, let me build components that are lifecycle aware that don't need to be kind of managed by the fragment or activity. Uh, let's you know, make it easier to do object storage. So you know, let's build a really lightweight wrapper on SQLite to do that. And you know, then let's have an easier way to kind of like hold data for activities or fragments in a way that's going to survive across configuration changes but not leak memory. And so as well as the components, we're also launching guidance around a, a recommended app architecture that ties them all together. So you know, a way to build apps that's really modular, testable, very robust, but is also just very clean and will result in writing less code than you did before. So where can developers go and find more about this? Yeah, so uh, we have a site at developer.android.com slash arch. There you'll find you know, samples, code labs, really good documentation, the guide app architecture. And you know, you don't, you're not required to move all your apps over to this if you don't want to. You know, the components are very mix and match, and none of this is required. But we do recommend that you know, if you know, you're not 100% happy with your app architecture or maybe you're starting a new project, you know, definitely we think this stuff is really, really great. You should check it out. And even if you're 100% happy with your app, we recommend reading our guide to app architecture mm -hmm. because it has principles that we think apply to all apps. So, you know, investigate it, check it out, you know, use what you want, you know, ignore what you don't like. Uh, but we think everyone should, you know, just kind of check out at least the guide because it has just really useful principles. Yeah, and once you build something really interesting, do let us know so we can actually take a look at that. Thank you.